My dog's eye is jacked up. And I don't mean jacked up in the way many of you know it's jacked up with the cherry eye thing. It's like red and it's, it's a mess right now. And so uh, as it has gotten worse over the past day or so, my wife and I have looked at each other and said, what do, should we take him to the vet? What do we do about this? And I, I don't know, like, I, I don't know. So we're having to make this decision about this dog with incomplete information. And I don't wanna to go to the vet if I don't have to, but I also don't want him to suffer or to get messed up because we didn't take him to the vet. And as a leader, as someone who's responsible for others and for outcomes, you're going to have to make decisions and you're probably going to have to do it with incomplete information. And the best part is you will likely be judged by others later on once more information is available. The problem is as a leader, you have to make the decision now and you have to take responsibility for that. So it is, it is easy to want to sit and wait for more information, but you don't have that luxury. And while that may be difficult to deal with and that may be something that is unpleasant, if you wanna be a leader, you're putting yourself in a position to say, I will make the difficult choice. I will make the decision about what needs to happen and I'm gonna do my best to get all the very best information but it is almost certain that you're not going to be afforded the time or the opportunity to have all the information. So I'm sorry that that is the case, but that is what leadership is all about. So when in doubt, choose. When in doubt, when you're not sure what to do, you've got to make a choice. That's your job as a leader. And all the other people who are following you, they get the benefit of going second. They get the benefit of not being the person who had to make the difficult choice. But just so you know, you're not alone. I, I feel that. I feel the stress and the strain of having to make those choices. It's just the cost of leadership.